I'm going to be showing you how to mount a piece of artwork that the student has done for the Art Docent Show. <clears throat> First of all, if you could cut using the, um, the paper cutter in the art room, a backing. It could be black, it could be any dark color, it kind of depends on what you like um, and what looks good with the student's art, but generally black is used. The black piece should be cut slightly larger than a piece of artwork. So when the art is mounted on it, it looks um, like it's in a frame. So I take the student's artwork. Hopefully the student's name is clearly located at the bottom, but we'll also add a label later to uh, help identify the student and the class and the, uh, the title or the subject of the painting. So I take the painting, I take a glue stick, you could also use uh, just regular Elmer's glue I suppose, and then you apply the glue to the back of the student's art. If you would like, you could, you know, if there's some extraneous pieces of white here, maybe I could also paper cut that off as long as it doesn't detract from the patient or from the student's artwork. <clears throat> I can then center it or maybe have it slightly above center on my uh, backing and then press firmly. If there's some areas that don't stick, you know, you could then kind of go back and add some glue just to get those extra corners down just so it sits flat. It might be a better thing to remember to do before you put it on there, but there we go. So now all my edges are flat. It's in there. The art is on the backing. And then I can turn my attention to labeling the art. This particular uh, student's name is Scott. So I would write Scott and last name, you can put the initial um, or the full name if there's more than one student with the same last initial. The subject of this would be artists, paint, pets, or you could just say pets or you know, whoever, whatever fits on your label. And then the teacher's class uh, it, uh, this particular class was Lauer, and you could put that at the bottom there. Just identifying the student, the subject, and the teacher's name on the piece of label. And then I can place that at the bottom of the mat. There we go. So now it's, uh, you know, you could place this either with all the chosen pieces of that class together. Um, so when you go on the uh, open house night, the, uh, the art show night, you have all the pieces that you want hung, um, uh, you know, in one place. That way you're not searching through all the, the different bags finding it. Um, 